Yo, what's up Metal Militia? Welcome to our countdown of the top selling Anthrax albums. We're diving deep into the history of one of the most badass bands to ever thrash. These guys are the real deal, pure, unadulterated heavy metal. Today we're ranking the best of Anthrax according to their sales numbers. It's a brutal battle for the top spot with some iconic albums going head to head. We're talking monstrous riffs, killer vocals, and enough energy to level a city. So crack open a cold one, crank up the volume, and get ready to mosh as we count down the albums that made Anthrax a household name. First up, we've got Among the Living. Released in 1987, this beast of an album just exploded onto the scene. Caught in a mosh, Indians, I am the law. Talk about an anthem for the ages. This album was a game changer, man. It hit number 62 on the Billboard 200 charts. Think about that for a second. This was a time when thrash metal was still fighting for mainstream recognition, but Anthrax, they didn't give a damn. They just brought the noise and the fans, they went wild. Among the living went gold in just a couple of months and then platinum. Now it's double platinum, baby. That's the power of pure, unadulterated thrash. Next up, it's Persistence of Time. This album, released in 1990, showed a different side of Anthrax. It was heavier, darker, more experimental. You can hear the maturity in their sound and the critics, they ate it up. This album cracked the Billboard Top 10, peaking at number 24. It was their highest charting album at the time. This was huge for Anthrax, man. It showed they weren't afraid to evolve, to push the boundaries of their sound, and the fans stayed with them. Persistence of Time went gold just a few months after its release and eventually hit platinum status, proof positive that Anthrax could conquer any territory they set their minds to. Now, we're, we're going back to 1985 with Spreading the Disease. This was their second album, and it's a straight-up thrash metal classic. This is the album that put Anthrax on the map. It peaked at number 113 on the Billboard 200, which might not sound like much, but trust me, it was a huge deal back then. This album spread like wildfire through the underground scene, turning heads and igniting mosh pits everywhere. Spreading the disease went gold in 1990 and eventually achieved platinum status in 2001. This album is a testament to Anthrax's raw talent and their ability to write songs that just stick with you. Now, uh, let's talk about State of Euphoria from 1988. This album just explodes with energy. It's Anthrax at their most fun, most infectious. The album hit number 30 on the Billboard 200, proving that Anthrax wasn't just a flash in the pan. They were here to stay, and they were only getting bigger. The album went gold in just a few months, proving that Anthrax had tapped into something special. This was the sound of a band at the top of their game, riding high on the thrash metal wave. State of Euphoria is a reminder that even when they're having fun, Anthrax can still deliver the goods. Last but not least, we have Sound of White Noise from 1993. This was a turning point for Anthrax. They brought in John Bush on vocals, and their sound took a heavier, more experimental turn. Some people didn't know what to make of it, but you know what? Anthrax didn't care. They were pushing boundaries, and that's what makes them so damn great. The album debuted at number seven on the Billboard 200, their highest chart position ever. Sound of White Noise went gold later that year, proving that Anthrax could evolve and still dominate the charts. Thanks for joining us on this journey through Anthrax's top-selling albums. These guys are true pioneers of thrash metal, and their music continues to kick ass. From the raw energy of spreading the disease to the experimental fury of sound of white noise, Anthrax has always stayed true to themselves while pushing the boundaries of metal. They're an inspiration to us all, reminding us to never back down, never compromise, and always crank it to 11. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more music rankings and reviews. And remember, support the bands that make the music you love. Keep it heavy, my friends.